Good morning, people here from Epcot for the Festival of Arts. I'm going to be trying the different foods around the different pavilions and seeing the different artwork. It's actually a really chilly day here. It's about 50, I think 55 degrees Fahrenheit. And usually I'm used to it being like 70 something, 80 something degrees. So journey with me and we adventure around here at Epcot. This is what it looks like for the Festival of Arts, so let's go. quickly so I can't wait to get it so this is where the new mouse gear location store is it used to be like at the front of the park where the fountain used to be and they moved it in the back corner kind of like going toward um uh mission space and test track area but it's a little corner now still waiting in line to pick up a pass holder back there what the new castle woman it looks like it's pretty cool really nice it's paint all over it and this is inside of the new mouse gear store so this is a new merch for the festival of arts this is their spirit jersey Let's see. it says figment and they got mugs oh look they got Reusable straws and a key. Mm -hmm. Ears. And this is all the Star Wars merch from the Mandalorian. You got long sleeves, growing t shirt, baby Yoda. Sweatshirt. It's pretty cool. I mean, this store is not as big as the original one, but it's it's nice. It has everything you need here, as far as merch goes. <laughs> so this is some of the cool 2D chalk artwork that they do here. Thank you so much. Thank you very much once again. And welcome. Monorail. 
So the first foodie stand of the day is here at Pop Eats. I ordered the chicken and this is what it looks like. Looks all pretty. Let's see if it tastes as good as it looks. to be the food test to see what it tastes like and if it's as good as it looks. So, it's the end. Bad, but I think it looks more prettier as decoration. All right, next pavilion I'm at is China. So I ordered the beef. I don't know how to pronounce the other word. I think it's shagumi or something. And this is what it looks like. Let's see how it tastes. That's a little kick to it, kind of a little spicy, but it's pretty good. have dish when you come to China. So I'm at my last pavilion update. I came to France and they have this brie which is basically a bread and inside of it it's like some kind of cream cheese. That's it. Really really creamy. Another dish that um, I got was this chocolate cake. Mm. Who does not like chocolate? Oh. Look at it. Oh. Look at this gushes out the chocolate. Mm. It's nice and warm. Mm. Really two good dishes here in France. So here at Animal Kingdom, I decided to come to this park because I haven't been here in a while and I pretty much did everything at Epcot. And um, I'm gonna head over to Expedition Everest because it's one of my favorite rides here. I love roller coasters. And sometimes if the standard line is really long, you can just go hop into single riders because it's usually cut in half or maybe shorter. So if you can't grab a fast pass, that's a pro tip for you guys if you want to go on one of those big attractions. So I'm going to take you guys along with me and go on my favorite ride. Is the wait for this? Whoa! 
I haven't seen it this long in a long time. 95 minutes to stand by. Fine. You have your band secure? Oh, I Oh, it says single rider line is open. It says 30 minutes, but sometimes what the wait time is posted is not really the actual wait time. It might say 30 minutes, but you might wait shorter than that, like 10 minutes or so. Because, like, from this point, you just go around one corner. We're basically on the ride. And they just fill you in the spots that are empty. Here at Animal Kingdom, and I'll see you guys on the next adventure. 